Hello everyone, now we are going to learn how we can configure the DHCP server in this router. If you remember this is the router just now we assigned the IP in our previous class. Now I need to enable the DHCP server here so this our computer can get the IP from the DHCP server. If you see when I click like DHCP here we are getting request uh, requesting IP and you can see we are getting DHCP fail here. DSCP fail here and you are getting the APIP ID here. Why? Because DSCP is not configured here. So what I will do? I will configure the DSCP. So I will go to the console of uh, console of the router. Okay, I am using this console cable to configure the router. So what I will do here? I will do the basic configuration. IP already we have, I think. Let me check IP we already configured now I need to configure the DSCP. So how we can configure the DSCP this is simple only just go here write IP DSCP pool any name you can give pool name I am giving ABC after that you need to write network and write the network ID what IP you want to give example I want to give 192.168.1.0 I forget here one let me write here one 192 168 1.0 I wrote after that whatever the subnet mass I want to give I will give give space write 255.255.255.0 and press enter then you need to write default route default router and here you need to give the gateway so gateway will be the router interface IP we configure this so this way we configure the DSCP server this is a DSCP server configuration if you see from here to here okay and if you want to exclude some IP you can write IP DSCP exclude address and you can write which address you don't want to give example I don't want to give 1.1 .1 because it is present to the gateway okay you can press enter after that if you want to test open any computer here okay and before you get the pipa like this so now you try and check you are getting the IP from the DSCP so this way you will configure the DSCP we get the correct IP if you want to try with the another computer you can try also with the another computer click here DSCP and you get the IP a pipa you don't have a pipa you get the correct IP DSCP request successful